Hello, my dearest. It's me, Kiyosaki Jackie, and welcome to Amnesia Rebirth. I'm quite scared now because I just saw the monster. Like, I know where the monster is. And now I'm scared that depending on what I do, he's just going to come running after me. I don't want that. I like peaceful exploration in a horror environment without monsters on my knees, if that makes sense. But I don't think that's an option. Maybe the, maybe the game would be a little bit boring if that was happening. I don't know where I have to go. <laughs> I'll figure out where I have to go first. I should have figured that out before. Okay, apparently there's only one way to go and it's up. This is the only way to go. I've been looking around other doors and other things, but no. This is the only way to go. Oh, boy, how I hate that. Up, oh, right? There's nothing there. No, definitely nothing there. Okay, I'm fine. <laughs> Oh my dear god, why? I'm okay. I am okay. I'm 100% okay. <laughs> oh, my heart. <laughs> Are they going to explain what's wrong with her? At this point, I just, I got like, okay, I understood that she probably has a sickness that's going to, like, kill her or something. But, what sickness is it? What is that? Okay, nice, nice. Interesting. This doesn't look like the other word at all. This just looks like the, like the previous word that I've, I was in. Okay, okay. Does he have anything in here? No? Okay, it just... Alright. My cat doesn't look like it. Why does it look like a mix? This looks like a perfect mix of words. Like a little bit of mine, a little bit of theirs. I clicked with that, right? Oh my god, my sense of direction why? What's making this thing shine? Oh, you wrote down something. Okay, what did you write down? Oh, I need to power this up in order... Okay. I gotcha. I gotcha. Is this a radio? It was! Hi, Yasmin. Yes, yes, hello, I'm here, I'm here. I'm, I'm trapped, I'm in a tomb. You need to take care. I told you. Doctor? Oh, damn. Well, I suppose at least they can't be far. Well, they might as well be on the moon. <laughs> Unless we can get out of here. Why would they be on the moon? It's more like probably you were on the moon, aren't they? Diagram. God, diagram on wall, map, liliness, star charge, position and radium spectrum akin to wavelength, must test complete paths. Well, I don't know. I am not the expert. Uh, excuse me, rope. You look very important, but apparently I cannot get you. Perhaps there was once a real person called Chin Hinan, a leader of her people. If so, she is likely buried in a Tuareg tomb far above us. There are others, much older stories that have been conflated with hers. Legends of the Grey Lady, a goddess who walks the desert. Legends of a healer, legends of an empress. I think these are ancient memories of what truly happened in this place. I have to say that part of me loves the sound design and the other part of me hates it.
Okay, I just climbed it like a car. Oh, you were a much more complicated version of that thing. Okay, okay, I see you. I see you. I think. I swear I hear footsteps everywhere! I hate this! Can you stop with the footsteps and like crawlings and stuff? It just really feels like I want to like turn the volume down. Okay. Well, it's really dark in there. I just want to turn the volume all the way down so I don't hear all the... Like, damn. Stop. Okay, this is a puzzle, but I need to see how does it go. Also, I can change the symbols. Are you going to draw something? Alright. Oh, sorry, sir. I think you're dead here for a very long time, aren't you? It's like, what is this going to draw? And how am I supposed to know what it is supposed to draw? I think it's just things that I'm going to figure out as I go. Most probably I have to go there. That definitely looks like a place I need to go. Oh, this one is stuck. Okay, there's always one stuck as a clue, apparently. Do you only have one eye? Oh, no. Okay, you probably died from trauma on the head. Oh, hey, baby! Baby, don't! This place is so strange. Who on earth built it, do you think? Huh? Who on earth? Or maybe nobody on Earth. Uh, this place is weird. Who the hell would build a tent here? So many places up there to build a tent and you want to make one down here? Alright, that's up to you, I guess. I wouldn't sleep here. I don't like when I see those <laughs> holes in the wall. I I need I think I need more clues before I figure out what the proper position of this is cuz I don't think I have those okay. Yeah, I figured. Wow. I just need to figure out this, though. Let me check if I can go on that door first. I don't think I can, though, because of these. Oh, I actually can. Okay, you're pretty dead. Oh, no, I can't. Okay, so I cannot go anywhere. I have to figure out the puzzle. Okay. Well, not a problem. I think I just did it, so... Let's press some buttons and see what I can do with that. I really feel like the monster is just going to come after I finish this, but... Alright. Let's see. I think I see exactly where you are. Yep, and then up like that. Boom! Nice! Well, I guess that's worked. Apparently. Let's hope that's fixed the portal. I think that did way more than just fixing the portal, lady. Oh, hey, baby! You good? Hello. Hello, little one. It's good to know I'm not alone. You should have a name. Salim and I, we... We never talked about it. His mother was Amara. So you shall be Amari. <laughs> that works for a boy or a girl. <laughs> Hello, little Amari. Amari? 
Amari. I hear Amari and I can only think about Anna Amari from Overwatch. <laughs> I don't want to go back in there. Oh, I know, I know. Okay. Well, that should have worked the portal, right? Should have wakened the monster as well. Not far now, we'll soon be home. Okay. Good. Tinker! I don't know what that does. Okay, I have this now, so uh, I should be able to like make the portal work, right? Hey, Amari, what's up? All I have to do is control myself. Stay out of the darkness. Guess how easy that's going to be. I'm just gonna run. I'm just gonna run. Please open. Please open. What? Why are you not working? No, there's definitely something wrong here. Oh, I see. There. Okay. Is this a battery? It looks like a battery. So yeah, there's that third one. Um, where could I... I hate this, I hate this, I hate this, I hate this, I hate this. I wish I, I, I wish I have just come here and do not notice that there's a goddamn monster just like right there. Okay. Oh, okay. <laughs> well, there. <laughs> come on. There we go. Now we go for it. Come on. Now you work. Yeah. Nice. Can I go? Oh no, don't break on me. Oh shit. No. Something's still wrong here. Oh, I need a battery. This one is empty, I think. Okay, where am I going to find a battery? I think that's the only place that has a battery because you know there was no other way to go like where I was no battery under desert ruins and ruined bricks what was this place about? some sort of outpost for that other world okay there's probably a battery there somewhere because there there wasn't. I went there, I went up there, I just did all the things. There was no battery there, right? I would have seen it. So I guess this is the way to go. Oh my god, baby, just stop! Just making sure you're all right, little Anna. Can you stop kicking? I'm not going to check on you the next time that you kick. You're still down there, right? I don't like what I'm hearing. <laughs> uh, I thought I would have to come in here, but I don't think so. Because I cannot open this door. Well, they have the same symbol. This is the exact same symbol of the thing there. Oh. Um. You look like I can put a battery in you. Okay, that's why I could pick up the battery from there. 
I see what I have to do and I hate it. Okay. Oh, oh psh, psh, psh. leave me alone. Fine, what do you want? I hope this isn't giving you nightmares, little one. It's giving me nightmares. I'm having nightmares. It took me a lot to like on the last episode to like get over the last monster. I even have to watch had to watch like Marker Player and stuff. So now what do I have to keep watching him until I see this monster and be like, okay, it's just a bunch of pixels, it's going to be fine. Cause I swear, if I haven't seen that, I don't think I would have be I would have been able to pass the other thing. The, the the thing that I had to like act actively run from it. There we go. Open it. Yes. Okay, let's go in. Yay! Adventures. Are you ready, little one? She didn't look happy at all. Is she sick? What happened? Can someone please explain to me what was going on with this baby? Oh, great. Alright. Nothing to be seen here. No, thank you for the matches, but I might hold it a little bit from now. Any others? Like, there's a candle here. Anything else to light up? No? Okay, now you can give me the matches. Woo! Three! Nice! Thank you! Damn! Where am I? Is this a chair? That's a really nice chair. I like it. T A H. T A H. It's not Dutch, Stephanie. It's English. We cannot reach the device. Attempts to break the metal have failed, as it is of the same strange composition as the Leyden jars. A uh, through of analysis is a through analysis is impossible until we can get closer. But my theory is that the laden jars are containers for some form of energetic etheric fluid, and that the device in the room below is some means of gathering such fluid to fill those jars. What exactly it is drawn from it from it's unclear. Surely not simply the surrounding atmosphere, you would require something with a great deal more vitality. I have sent the boy Rashid below with a paint pot and brush, and told him to mark any route he finds. Oh, thanks! Clearly. Yeah, that's, uh, that, that's going to help, I think. That's probably going to help. I just need to follow the routes. Right? That the boy or she is going to make. Oh. All empty. I know it's all empty, but if I have to fill it, then I might need an empty one. There's too many pads here, I don't like it. Okay. That's a lot of batteries in here. What was that supposed to be? Like a dragon? Oh, that symbol again! T-H... T-A-H. Khaled has excavated several more laden jars, which are fully energized. While it is clear that they are required to power the portal device, without another orb I am unwilling to waste them on the, re on the test. However, I am now certain the contents of this jar, this fluid-like energy, is the Vitae of which I'll accept. There is spoke. I don't know what's going on in my throat. If I remember from the previous amnesia... Oh, 
Thank you. Thank you. You're marking the darkest of the paths, aren't you? Fucking lovely of you. Jesus Christ. Oh, is that, that was your head. Okay. But yeah, the, at least in the previous amnesia, the attempts of getting the Vitae. Is any secrets in here? This looks like a place full of secrets. No? Okay. Was by uh, torturing people. Oh, more matches. Oh, I cannot carry more matches. Okay. Like, we had to torture people and, and, and then... Uh, yeah. From that torture, the people would be full of the Vitae that we needed. Because of the whole, like, fear and, and everything like that. Anyway, I'm going here first because there's light. <laughs> you never go on the dark path first. You explore everything that you can first. Oh, it was me. Okay. More matches. Amazing. You're giving me a lot of light. Oh, God. That's terrifying. Under the sign of the seven on the third rise at the second calling, I, Karangi, make this record. The harvesters have adapted to the refinements to the hunting ground. Over the last ten rises, I mark a full yield of 17 cells, which is an improvement of four cells over the previous cycle. Mareku suggests that the new transfiguration batch may be a contributor. I advise a cycle with prior harvester stock to eliminate uncertainty. So recorded in her name eternal. So, were you guys doing the same? Why does it feel like I can open this? Oh, it's a whole door. Okay. Cans! Yay! Huh. So yeah, they harvested the Vitae in this previous uh, ancient civilization as well. Baby! In this ancient civilization as well. That means too dark down here. It's changing me a little more. I don't know what's happening to me. We're going to turn into a ghoul as well. I feel like I'm losing control. Oh, relax. It's not that dark. Like, you know, scared of it, are you? I am. I don't like it. Okay. Oh, great. I cannot light anything. Oh, no need to. That's neat enough. Why are you scared off? Oh, the hole. Let's, let's, uh, pile those rocks in the hole. <laughs> let's, uh, block the hole. So then you don't get scared of it. Okay? Okay. We're locked on the other side, I think. Hey, there's a dead person in there. <laughs> what? Was that Afrikaans? I think that was Afrikaans. Can I throw something at it? Like a rock? Yes! That's exactly what I do. Okay. Um. Yes, I did it. Now. Who said ignited me? Hi. Alex. Oh, it's Alex Sterling. Oh, okay, it's your friend. Oh god, no. What is I'm this? So sorry. Oh, oil. Go. Oh. Follow her. Save Hank. I'm going after Richard. Best of luck, Tarzi. Well, uh, 
I think, I think, not much of a luck, because uh, he's pretty dead. All these spiders are off. Hey, I can go to this room and not immediately to the dark hell. I don't know if I like it. Hi, baby. I feel a bit better in here, little Emily. Just you rest. <laughs> Alex, darling. He and Richard were in love. I knew when I first saw them. Sitting beneath the trees in the hotel garden. With Richard complaining about the coffee. It was in every look they shared. Oh, nice! I can read that one. Under the sign of Auranga, on the second rise, the second calling, I, Karangi, make this record. We have identified a fault in the revised layout for the hunting ground genting system, where previously the harvesters had lieu, had leeway, leeway to stock the subjects for at least 100 idar. Oh my god, the current configuration lowers that to 30 as the subjects simply panic and stampede. This does not give enough time for an appropriate build-up of harvestable energy within their systems. I recommend restoring the previous configuration temporarily while we re-evaluate. So recorded in her name eternal. So yeah, and these are just like tablets that you really cannot read. Okay, I don't know if it's chest? Or if this is like how you manage something? I don't think that's important by now. But okay, uh, what I understood so far. I want to say that because I'm about to finish the episode. So <laughs> let me close this door. Let me close it. Beautiful. And lock it. <laughs> and now I'm safe in here. Yes, I am 100% safe in here. But what I wanted to say is, okay, from the previous game on the first amnesia, the Vitae came from the people that were being tortured and it would gather like this energy they emanate because they want to live. And this feeling of I want to live, I want to live, it was what made them like half the Vitae. So that's why you had to like torture the person. And what I'm seeing here seems like they do something similar. They have these people, the harvesters, and they're probably doing something similar to them to extract this energy. And that's where I think the ghouls came from. So probably this ancient civilization made the ghouls from like all this drain energy thing. The whole civilization went off because of the portals and probably a few ghouls ex escaped reach some people that were living there and they created the whole myth of the ghoul that was just a monster from another civilization in another time but that's what just i think uh so i don't know we're, we're gonna see on the next episode what the hell is going on so anyway i hate the sound i hate what what creeps me out on this game is the sound you're just standing there and you keep hearing the as if there's someone walking and you're going to find them like right behind the corner. I hate it and I love it at the same time. It's just amazing. Sound design. Great. I love it. But anyway, <laughs> I'm going to finish this episode here. Get a coat because I'm getting cold from the scares. And uh, yeah, leave a like if you enjoy it. Please subscribe to the channel for more. I'm going to play tons of other games besides this one. And as usual, hope you all have a happy ever after. And I'll see you on the next day. Bye bye.